Hi everybody. I made a couple updates here. I took those uh, metal clips there. They have a little finger tong on the inside of the fan. I took and clipped those off because they were actually slightly clipping the fan blades themselves when the fan was spinning around. Uh, I don't think that contributed to any of the extra power draw, uh, but it certainly did have a small noticeable tick noise that I could hear. I didn't like it, so I got rid of that. The other thing I did was I took all three of those fans I took their plugs and converted them over to two-pin Molex connectors. The reason I did that was because I wanted to connect them directly to the power supply, and almost every single power supply uses four-pin Molex connectors. So I figure if I ever have to replace the power supply, I can connect them right up, simple and easy, no more problems. By doing that, I lighten the load on my fan controller here, so I won't have to worry about overheating the fan controller anymore. He's now running directly connected, directly soldered on, and the only fans that are going to the fan controller are the radiator fans. I'm giving this guy an overnight test run. The last guy, I couldn't let him make it through the night because he was way too hot. So, assuming this works out, my next goal is to decorate a little and put in my two other graphics cards. This is still the 8800 GTX. My plan is two 580s. And I'm going to put in some LED strips. I'm planning on a, a four strings of green LEDs, I think, uh, behind the motherboard to give it a nice glow coming out from behind the motherboard. I might just do two strips uh, down in the middle somewhere uh, where the glow can leak out from the back edge of the motherboard. The LED strips will be on the motherboard uh, tray, but behind the motherboard. So all you get to see is the glow and not uh, direct LED light. The other thing I think I'd like to try is put some orange LED strips or maybe stick with the green, because I've heard combining colors can be horrible, uh, into the actual metal channels of the external frame, but facing the tank. So between, you know, between the tank, not between, but in the metal channel facing the tank, because I think that might be cool. It might uh, light up uh, some of the edging where the polycarbonate was bonded and light into the tank in a nifty way. So I'll order a couple pieces and see what I can do and see how it looks. And my plan is to hook those LEDs up to the fan controller too so I can uh, dim them if that works out. Let me know what you think.